So to learn the place, we have a pick and a place. So to place the parts, you click learn place. And before you do a learn place uh, portion of this, you want to click yes to relearn the fiducial points. And we'll go and find all the fiducial points. And these I've already uh, put in there. So right here is one of the 10 Pico fairs. Click learn by camera. It'll go to what I already learned, or already taught. So this is C1. So let's go ahead and delete this one. Click OK. And so now if we go back in there, we can get to it through here too, place. I already learned the fiducial points, so I'm not worried about being uh, offset. So that one is no longer in there. So I want to insert it by clicking Insert. And I know it's a 10 Pico fare that I took out, so I want to select it right here from my list that I have done in my, my pick menu. So D12 is my 10 Pico fare. Click Select, and there it is but it has a zero, zero reference, X zero, Y zero. That's how it gets imported. Uh, I need to now teach it where it is. So any field on this line, I can just click learn by camera. And it just so happened this is at zero, zero location. So I can go right here and rotate it 90 degrees, 45 or five. You can keep rotating it around, get it pretty much centered. This is in a very critical uh, size component to place. Click OK. OK, well, I guess the, the zero, 00 wasn't there before, and now it's they got the actual locations. So you then keep going down, and you can just keep appending, appending, and adding uh, your parts that way. So here they all are, and uh, once again I can do um, click append here, and then you have room for another one. So if I had another part, I would just click in the feeder field, feeder column, and it'll bring up all the parts that I have loaded to be picked. And I would just select whatever one I wanted, let's go with this one, and then learn by camera would ask me where I wanted to place it and you want to do all these places on the first panel only because then all the other ones will just be duplicated of this. So click cancel and I'm going to go ahead and uh, delete this one out and click OK.